Hi guys and welcome to another episode of Travel and Chew. I of course am your favorite host Jay. And I'm Keisha. And we're coming to you guys live today from the vehicle as you can see. On our way to our next destination. Decided to wake up a little earlier today to go out and do a breakfast locale. Um, haven't done breakfast in a while, so this is gonna be a great experience this morning for you guys. So stay tuned, okay? Yes, we just came from church. AME Bust It Down Baptist Church located on the side of the road in South Side, Atlanta. Hallelujah. Get man. into it. Get okay. Into it. <laughs> Pastor is ratchet as me. Yes, yes, yes. So guys, you know what I mean? So look that Bust It Down AME Church down. <laughs> look it up. Y'all tell them. <laughs> And we're gonna let y'all guys enjoy some of this great scenery while we're going to our location today, all right? See you in a minute. So, we've arrived. We're here in Buckhead, yes. in Atlanta, Georgia, at the Corner Cafe. Today, like I said, we're going to partake in some great breakfast items. So, um, as you can see behind me, this is the outside locale for the Corner Cafe. It's right across the street from what we call the Buckhead Diner. And uh, right down the street is Fogo the Child's, if you're familiar with the Atlanta area. But if not, those are some great hints for you guys. Um, Keisha, what are you, are you ready for today? Yay! Hey, let's go ahead and chomp in. Go. So guys, as you can see, they have a coffee bar and this is their chalkboard that lets you know all the drinks and coffees and cocktails that they have. They also have wine, which is good. And of course, when you walk in directly, they have their pastries right in front of you so you can see what they serve. And of course, they have cookies and things that you can buy right there. And also they have their, their selection. You have your muffins, you have your scones. Oh, they look good. You have your croissants. Then you have your slices of cakes, as well as whole cakes. Look at that chocolate cake. All oh, that looks so yummy. Mmm! I'm getting hungry all over again. We've been seated here at the Corner Cafe here in Buckhead in Atlanta, Georgia. Um, Keisha has got her a little starter here. She's pouring her cream in her coffee. She's grown this morning. So, what are you partaking in over here, Keisha? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> um, I did get a coffee. You got your creamer. It looks like they have coffee seed muffins, chocolate chip. Ooh. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. I'm going to bite into it. So, let me just bite into it. I feel this might be a crunch. I don't want to bite into all of them and you not see it. It looks like some type of cream cheese type deal or crumble. It looks like a crumble. Yeah, a crumb cake type deal, maybe. Oh, it got okay. blueberries in there. Okay, so it's possibly a blueberry. Okay. okay. I'm eating up all the stuff. <laughs> all right, so we're back here and I'm partaking in my chai latte, which is not warm at all. Tastes pretty good, real good as a matter of fact, but it's very lukewarm, not even Luke, more like Matthew warm. So um that will be returned. They may lose a part or two because my drink is not warm as I like it. Hey guys, welcome back. Mm. They brought me another chai latte. This one is very warm. Just like I like it. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna go ahead and put some ghetto in this thing. Mm. See that steam on them? Yeah, the steam is very, very good here. So, I'm very pleased now with my latte. Waiting on the main courses. I ordered a tenderloin steak with eggs today. It come with these small potatoes. So, we're going to see how that looks when it gets here. Keisha, what did you order today? Oh, look at the poor baby. As she gets her fresh coffee poured. 
<laughs> Keisha, well, why are you so sad? Well, if you must know, since you're in my face. Mm. Originally, guys, I wanted to get the shrimp and grits. Unfortunately, the sauce that goes in the shrimp and grits has sausage in it. I don't do sausage. So that was <laughs> so that was one. I wanted a coffee with a little pretty design on the inside with the heart or the flower or leaf or whatever. Yeah. They don't do that here. Oh, right? wah, wah. So I really had my heart set on shrimp and grits. But I but I got the uh, jumbo love crab cake instead. I think okay. it comes with brioche toast. So I'm, I'm kind of in a downer, so I may not be as lively as you guys would like. Oh. But I hope they got a poppy seed muffin. Okay. So we all know what poppy does. So I'm going to eat it and see if it'll give me a little perk up. <laughs> see, because I need it. And yes, as soon as those first takes arrive for their main courses, we will return, guys. But my poor, poor co-host, y'all pray for <laughs> We'll be back. Aww. <laughs> Alright everybody, it is chow time. The main courses have arrived. So as you can see, I have my steak. How did you get it prepared? I got the steak tenderloin prepared, medium well. We'll cut right into that bad boy for you. See, just a little bit of pink. But it's warm. Mm. Very good. Okay. Flavor very well. Okay. Mm. I'm waiting on some Heinz 57 sauce to go with it, so give me a few minutes. Now these are my cheddar scrambled eggs. Mm. Mm. What's that green sauce? That's a great question. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. That's a great question. These um, I need to ask my server what that that garnish is around my plate. And those but, um, are um, these are the Vidalia fried onions. Okay. Fried onions for dinner. So I'm gonna dig in. So you said that is? Ah, uh, got the runny middle. Oh God. Oh God, she doesn't like the runny middle. Oh my God, people, we're gonna have to make a, a new order. It doesn't seem well. It doesn't seem good. Okay guys, I have my fork and I'd like to taste my food. It took a minute. The service here is kind of lax. Even though this is a very popular spot, but the service here is kind of lax. So I'm eating into my potatoes. Potatoes are okay. I'm gonna eat my salmon on brioche with scramble and not the Benedict style. So guys, please pay attention to that whenever you're ordering anything Benedict because it's right, the egg is right. people we are now leaving the corner cafe located in Buckhead um, it was a uh, it was a great experience for the most part at the beginning but as we started getting to be you know what I mean around and our meal being served and things like that we had some some discrepancies like for instance the meal took a re relatively long time to come to the table um, I think we waited about 15 to 20 minutes Keisha says about 10 
Um, also, my eggs were a little more runny than I like. I got the scrambled eggs, but they were very soft scrambled. Um, didn't particularly like that. The service was a little eh. So my rating for one to five for this experience, I would say they would out of one to five stars, they would get two stars for this one. What about you? Well, um, I'm not gonna be as kind as Jay. I'm gonna start off with my rating. I give about a one. Ooh. Yeah, I know this is Buckhead, but I think you're paying for the ambiance. Um, it may be good for some, but for me, um, I wanted cheese and grits, like mm. I said in the beginning. Yeah. They have it on uh, the sauce has the andouille sausage in it, so mm -hmm. that was a no. I don't eat sausage. Yeah. Um, the second thing was, of course, Jay, like Jay said, the waiting was kind of slow. Yeah, they are very slow. Our, our waiter wasn't very attentive. We had a lot of our um, items that we ate, like the sauce, the sauces from the. Um, muffins yes yes they sat on the table for a minute yeah yeah some of our dirty it. dishes sat on the table yeah. for a long time jay had his child latte he was done with it that sat on the table for a long time mm -hmm. so service is not maybe they were just too busy today i don't know but service wasn't as good um it seems like, like yeah, it seemed like one of those restaurants where you're not really coming in a rush. You just want to sit there with your yeah. family or your, your, your whoever you come with and just lean back. One and thing I didn't like was that when I um, it went back, our waiter didn't bring the food back. Somebody else brought it back. So he didn't say, okay, he didn't check up on us. So check up is always good when you go right. into a place. Maybe, right. he, like I said, their attentive was not on his menu. All so right. again, I give it a one. When mm -hmm. I come back here, me, no. Corner Cafe, like it's not my favorite. You know what I mean, I, don't, I probably won't be doing this again either, but... Sorry, guys. As far as Travel and Chew, stay tuned for later and more exciting episodes of Travel and Chew. And as we say here on Travel and Chew, have a great day. And we also say thumbs up and subscribe. Thumbs up and subscribe, yes. yes. Remember that. Bye. Bye-bye.